Hi everyone, this is Ravi. Welcome to Tricentis Tasca SAP Automation Tutorial. I have received lot of requests from my YouTube subscribers to cover the topics related to SAP application automation by using Tricentis Tasca latest version. So I am going to teach you automating a SAP application and how can you automate the test cases related to your SAP application. I am going to post series of YouTube videos covering installation, downloading your task latest version and introducing system under test that is your SAP application and then how can you create a test case structure before you automate your test cases and then how can you create test steps by using Tosca latest version and also I'm going to teach you how can you provide test step values by using latest version Tosca 16 and then how can you scan your controls of your SAP application by using Tosca and then how can we create modules to automate your SAP application and I'm going to cover a lot of other automation concepts by using Tosca latest version 16. So please stay tuned. Please do subscribe to the channel. Click on bell icon. You'll receive notifications whenever I publish more videos. Thank you. To all viewers, uh, a big thank you whoever watching my YouTube videos. So what I can observe uh, around 86.8% .8 of the viewers are watching my videos but uh, they have not subscribed to my channel. I would recommend and I would request everyone please do subscribe to the channel and encourage me in posting more and more videos uh, which are helpful for you guys. Thank you. Okay, so now what is our first agent item? SAP automation using Tasca. Today you will start your journey through the automation of SAP testing using Tricentis Tosca 16 and I'm going to post a lot of videos as I explained to you by covering different topics of Tricentis Tosca automation by using SAP related applications. First of all, why and how Tricentis is a best solution for your SAP application? Let us understand. If you see on the screen, First, for any SAP related applications, SAP Solution Manager and SAP Cloud ALM involves, right? And then you need to understand change impact analysis of your SAP application. So this change impact analysis can be performed by using Tricentis Live Compare tool. So if you see at the bottom right side, I'm showing you the change impact analysis can be performed by using Tricentis Live Compare. So this way you will be understanding what to test for any kind of changes and what to test in your SAP application. So once you understand that, then it is your duty to automate your test cases continuously. So how can you automate your test cases continuously? by using Tricentis Tosca. So once you perform continuous test automation and then you need to see the scalability of your application. How can you perform the scalability of your application by using load testing? So load testing can be done by Tricentis Flood. So it's a one-stop solution. Tricentis is one-stop solution in automating your SAP related application and the test cases related to your SAP application. Hope you all understand the importance of Tricentis in automating SAP related applications. Now our next agenda is how can you download and install the latest version of Tricentis Tosca 16. Okay, so in this session, I'm going to teach you how to download and install 
latest version task 16 okay so if you see on the screen there are four steps that you need to follow first you need to register with your organization email id using the link that is displaying on the screen so i'm going to paste these links in the description so that you can use the links from the description section okay and then you have to log in to your support hyphen hub.tricentis.com by using the registered email id in the step one right and then you need to request for a license using the below link basically the link that is specified in the third step okay once you request for the license the license will be approved by the corresponding tricentis manager so once it is approved you are going to receive an email to download and install the tasca 16 version okay to download and install the tasca 16 version you need to use the link that is specified in the last step okay i'm going to paste all these links in the description okay so now let's jump onto the system and see how can we perform all these actions and how can we download and install tricentis tasca in windows machine so what is our first step you have to register with your organization email id using link right as i said earlier so this is the link let me go to the link uh, it's support hub dot dot com okay here you will find a register you'll find register link you need to click on register and then you have to provide all the fields here okay mister and what is your name first name last name and then your mobile number which is optional and then what is your country um, street city zip and then language what is your time zone right and you need to provide your business address okay so you need to provide your business address business email that means organization email so you cannot provide your personal email keep this in mind okay and then you need to confirm your organization email and provide your password and the confirm the password right and then click on i agree to the private policy and then i'm not a robot right and then you need to click on submit so as soon as you register you are going to receive an email to your organization email id okay and then you need to activate you need to confirm that the email has been received once that is done all you need to do is our next step is you need to log into support hyphen hub dot tricentis.com using the credentials that you have provided while registering okay so for me so i have already logged in here okay if you see support data uh, and then i am already logged into my user okay and then once you log into your support hyphen hub dot tricentis.com by using your organization credentials you need to request for license using below link okay let me show you that so this is the link i'm going to paste this link in the description i'm going to paste all the links in the description okay you can access all these links from the description okay so you need to click on request cloud training license as soon as you click on request cloud training license the request will be sent okay stating that deploying the status will be deploying i already sent this request earlier that's why it's got deployed and it's got approved once your training license cloud training license been approved then the state will be changed to deployed okay so in my case i've already raised a request as soon as you raise a request you will receive an email stating that the request has been sent to our support team okay once approved the status will be changed to deployed and then you are going to receive an email stating that the tricentis manager has been approved your 
license and then what you need to do you need to go to support hub tricentis.com third party license let me show you where uh, what i'm talking about so you need to go to this link okay i'm going to paste this link in the description okay and then you have to select tricentis tosca under tricentis tosca you can see tasca 16 version right you need to click on tasca 16 as soon as you click on tasca 16 it's going to download a dot exe file okay what i already downloaded okay let me show you what it's going to download okay so it will download this particular yeah so it's going to download your present is tasca software okay so let me show you how it looks like okay okay so this is the zip file so it will be downloading in the form of zip file okay so this way present is see present is tasca 16 okay and then you need to extract Tricentis Tasca 16. Okay, you need to extract the zip file. Once you extract, you just need to follow the instructions. You need to click on, double click on this LTS, 16LTS.exe file. And then, see, because I already installed, it is asking me to see, I mean, either uninstall, repair, or modify. Because I already installed. In your case, you will get a button, I mean, you will get a um agreement license agreement you need to check the checkbox and then you need to click on next and follow the instructions that displays on the screen it's very very simple self explanatory okay once you complete your installation once you complete your installation you should see a tasca commander how it's going to show so this is the tasca commander that you should see on the menu okay and you need to click on tasca commander as soon as you click on tasca commander a commander will be opened if you see this is my tasca commander right and if you observe about tasca so i i i, I clicked on tasca commander one more time that's why it's showing see if see this is my latest tricentis tasca 16 version okay very very latest which is released on 8th december i think 7th december or 8th december okay and if you go to about tasca so it shows you the version as 16 okay and i mean so as we are discussing i mean this session is all about installation and install installation and download so let me just quickly show you how this Tricentis Tasca uh, 16 is actually uh, the UI is okay. Tricentis Tasca UI. How does it looks like? Okay, let me quickly show you guys. Okay, one thing is hope you all understand how to download the .exe file and then install the .exe file. Okay. Once you download and install the .exe file, your Tricentis Tosca commander will be available in the start menu. Okay, Tosca commander will be available in start menu. So once that is done, how to get your license? How to basically activate your license? So the way is you have to click on project right i opened the tasca click on project go to license and here because your training license is cloud cloud based license you need to click on connect and then you have to select connect to cloud hosted license server because whenever you register and request for the cloud license for the training right a license related to cloud will be issued for the user okay you need to select 
cloud hosted license. In case if you have a self hosted license, then you can select this. Okay. In my case, it's a cloud hosted license and then click on OK. And then you need to provide the credentials that you have given while registering when you are registering to your support tricentit support dot hub right so the same email id and the same password you have to provide here okay so let me quickly provide the same email id and password that i have registered with okay as soon as you click on OK, what it will do? It's going to retrieve your cloud license. Okay. So retrieving your cloud licenses. And then, yes, you have successfully connected to the license server and can use Tosca Commander right away. Click on OK. And then you can start creating your first project by using latest Tosca 16 version. Hope. Oh. You all understand the concepts of why do we need Tricentis product to automate your test cases related to SAP application and then how can you download and install latest version of Tricentis Tosca 16. Please do subscribe to the channel, click on bell icon, you will receive notifications whenever I publish more videos. Thank you.